We're in Hollywood, California, on the set of Boss Man's new video, Break Me Off. Boss Man is one of the hottest artists signed to MySpace's record label, but he ain't new to the game. He came up in b -more. that's Baltimore for those of y'all who don't know. He made his bones for years putting out mixtapes, selling over 25,000 copies in Baltimore area stores alone, and also scored a few local radio hits before the major labels came calling. And he eventually signed to MySpace Interscope's new record label, where his 2009 Home of the Wire LP is due to release this year. You know what I'm saying? Be chilling out here in a Break Me Off video. Ain't no teamwork like the kind needed to put together a music video. And two of the most important members of that team are the DP, the director of photography, and the AD, the first assistant director. The director of photography is basically the photographer for television or motion pictures. He handles all the camera angles, anything to do with the camera and the lighting. And I like DPs that wrestle with the shots. Joe Labisi, um, he's a real pain in the ass. Well, his name is Rage. <laughs> I love him for it because he makes sure that the stuff I, I shoot with him is the very best it can be. Some directors I get, you don't hear a peep out of them all day. Right there, show me that right there, show me that right there. Not Dale. <laughs> You'll definitely hear from him. Xbox TV, insane action sports athletes. What the deal, this is DJ Muggs from the Mighty Cypress Hill, and I'm bringing you Mash Up Radio, baby. What do you get when you mix Nirvana, right? With my man Eminem. You know what you get? You get the freshest in Mash Up Radio, like this. This crazy motivated R&B vocalist from Waterville, Maine is nothing less than a self-made internet phenomenon. While hustling to get a major record deal on his own, he got impatient and posted one of his independent tracks entitled Rain on MySpace, which put the industry at full attention where he got an unprecedented 27 million hits. Even though he just forced his way onto the radar, he's still grinding his way from the ground up and could really benefit from having his first video done by the king of the grind, Rage. 